Just wanted to uh, show you a quick tip on actually getting uh, professional audio metering in Final Cut X. Um, first of all, what you'll need to do is basically download uh, two pieces of equipment, which will be um, PPM modulator and Soundflower. Now, once you've installed those two guys, you want to be going up and starting up Soundflower. So come up to here and search for your Soundflower. Once you find it, you'll see it installed here. Uh, this will be quite relevant right now. If it's off, um, you need to turn it to input out. Now, if you're running AGA or Blackmagic, that will be those cards there. So the next thing to do we need to do is to set it up. So we'll run up the PPM modulator right now. Just to show you what it's like. I'm in demo mode for this particular model. Now, you have a plethora of things that you can actually look at. Uh, you can have BBC, you can add loudness, true peak, which is quite, in, uh, quite good, and all these guys down through here. So what I've done, I've just set up for the stereo peak guy here. Now if I play it, let's have a look through here. Now you can see it working with the speaker here, but you can't actually hear it out, which is quite pointless. So what we'll do is um, nothing in through here. You need to jump into your system preferences and make sure that guy pops up. Check out your sound. And this is where the routing comes in. So your output is into Soundflower and your input is Soundflower as well. So Come back up to here, turn it off again, turn it on if you don't get the audio straight away, and now you should be able to hear it with whoever three as well. So there's a nice little handy hint for getting professional audio and video scope in there. Hope this helps. See you later.